filthy roads continue to be a danger to drivers. Good evening. I'm Katie Orth. And I'm Eddie Flores. Big Two's Felice Romero is out there braving the cold right now, and she joins us live. So, Felice, how are things right now? Eddie and Katie, it has stopped snowing, but with temperatures going into the teens tonight, these roads will freeze. You may think the roads are looking better, but hold that thought. Soon, they'll be covered in a sheet of ice. We're already starting to see more of that slush. See, that's the problem. You're thinking that it's all melting, but tomorrow morning, we'll be back down into the teens. So that'll refreeze on us, and then we'll have those icier conditions. Meteorologist Alexis Hermanson says early morning drivers can also expect fog, only adding to the dangerous driving conditions. This model is already showing some reduced visibility, and by the time we get to tomorrow morning, we're looking at less than five miles for our visibility in Odessa Midland, and even almost less than a mile for us in Big Spring. For those who have to be on the road Thursday morning, give yourself some extra time and drivers around you extra space. TechStop will be treating the roads as much as possible before the morning commute. Out on the road, which is basically salt water, it keeps the ice from forming such a strong bond with the road. We'll only be doing interstates, loops, 191, uh, maybe BI-20. We can't treat every lane mile of every road, so drivers really should act as if nothing has been treated and expect there to be ice and snow everywhere. You can stay updated on our weather conditions on our website, yourbasin.com. Reporting live in Odessa, Feliz Romero, Big 2 News.